We're on day 23 of the 30-Day Craft Room Organization Challenge, and today we're talking adhesives. If you're like me, you probably have lots of different kinds of adhesives, so let's talk about how you can organize them. First, I'd recommend having something for crafting on the go. This is my travel pouch that I take with me for classes that I attend or if I'm doing paper pumpkin on a trip or something like that. So it has everything that I need in it, specifically the adhesives. So I'm using up Old Snail and I have some dimensionals and glue dots in this caddy. Then I use this caddy that a friend gave me. The front pockets hold my Seal and Seal Plus and the back pockets hold an Old Snail, tear and tape, and some glue pens. And that caddy sits on top of these Sterilite drawers, which I actually found on the side of the road. It's perfect for my excess adhesives, so things like Mod Podge, adhesive sheets, contact paper, and whatnot. Then over on my lamp, I have three mini Sterilite drawers, and one of them is for adhesives that I can quickly grab and give to someone in a class or throw into a bucket. And so the top drawer is for mini dimensionals, the middle drawer is for dimensionals, and the bottom drawer is for glue dots and foam sheets. And since adhesives are considered a cash and carry item, we as demonstrators can have them on hand for people who need to buy them on the spot. So I use this cute little container from World Market that's labeled supplies to have extra adhesives on hand for people to purchase. So spend the day going through your adhesives, figuring out what you might be running low on or if there's a better way for you to organize yours so that you can easily get to what you need. If you're interested in learning more about adhesives, make sure you check out the description below with a link to another video where I talked about an overview of all the Adhesive Stampin' Up! offers. Happy crafting and happy organizing!